today's session. Uh, can I get a little bit more in this? Um, my mic in the downstairs. One, two. Come on, it's just gonna be here for a few minutes. One, two, yeah. Yo. Welcome to day two. Day two. Of the collector's edition. Y'all get the inside of the school. Andrews. Kevin Powell. Ace of War. Calvin Rogers. Frank Bruno. Philip Feaster. And, um, this is day two. Come on in. Day two, baby. Day two, day. Uh huh. Start from day two today. Start What's going on? Let me call some people out. Thomas was good. Chris was good. I think that's the one of us good. Jane was happy. Good afternoon, everybody. Mm. Mike Chico, what's going on? Jane. All right. Flipping all things just a little bit. I don't mind you here because it's going to be so different when you get it. Right. 25 years. Pages of life. We're reflipping it. What up, Rochelle? We love you too now.
So we're working out. <laughs> the leather couch is in the building. The leather couch is in the building. Yeah, that's where we sit. They chill out when they're not on them instruments. Gotta have a place to chill in the in the area. On that last inversion, right? Probably should do an accent right there. We can slow it down a little bit. It don't have to be right on the beat. You can drag it a little bit. You must be leaving. Then come back on the one. Mm, so that third time around will count. I'll sing it through with you so you know where it's coming. You must be living. Mm.
do I remember signing your bass at the Merit Center? Mm, maybe. Maybe. St. Louis Mo. From the Lou. What's going on, everybody? Biggest thing that happens when you get older and your voice and you've been hammering Learn in the minute that hour for since 94. Plus before that. First thing to go in the muscle is you get a slower vibrato. You notice a lot of our legends. And that's what I try to work on. I don't do a lot of runs. I'm not a person that ever did a lot of runs. I sing into notes. So I, my thing has been I transition into notes where the keyboard people are going, where the keyboard players are going. So I try to sing through and make different choices. That's what kind of makes me a little different. But I'm fighting. I have to fight that vibrato. I'm conscious that I have to keep that because it's just natural. It's natural. I heard the legend Stevie. That's the first thing that goes is our ability to just hang in there where we used to just hang. You know? Like an off tempo thing, if y'all could kind of vibe it like that, is what you think? I'm not going to do that, but you said you wanted to pull back a little bit, right? 
What's that? Yeah, just a little. Whatever y'all work with that, and then I'll the, have the vocals go with it. All right, a couple more minutes on, fam. A couple more minutes on, and I'll, I'll let you go. I ain't gonna keep you all day. I'll come back a little bit later on, let you hear what we're doing next. But and then after that, that's the end of the song. It's 25 years ago. Right. Pages of Life came out. Double platinum. Um, Lord put his fingerprint on it. I worked with a great person at the record company, the, the whole staff at Verity. It was great. But the person who believed in me the most was Clive Calder Clyde. from uh, Oh Clive. Oh, Clive. Yeah. He, 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 <laughs> hold on, say it. You said it just so confident. Clive Calder. <laughs> hey, you see? Don't know Clyde. Clyde was the guy, man. He was he was behind everybody at Jive. But he pulled me aside and said, I don't care how long it takes. And I just come out of a season where a lot of people, record companies and, and people that I, I knew, they did not believe. They didn't believe. They didn't. The record companies, they scoffed at RFC. They threw our stuff in the middle of the table, our first record. And, Coming up on David, they, they threw it in the middle of the table and they cussed that. They cursed it. Unless they literally cursed. They raised up some other groups. I won't even say their name. I don't want no problems. I said, this is the album going to take us to the top. And they took my album. And they threw it in the middle of the, of the um, table and said, F this other stuff. That's what they said. And I had a woman call me. She was crying. She left the meeting crying. She said, I'm leaving this place. It's demonic. And it hurt my heart because I was in, I was finishing up David. And literally it just broke my heart because I was just like, can't get a break. But RFC believed. And I believed. We believed. And we just kept working. They literally said, F this other S. Threw my record in the garbage. But a man believed in New York and bought the label based on my contract. Bought the label. And he pulled me aside. you the reason I bought that. I want you to take your time, sir. Make the record I know you can make. I don't care. I'm tell everybody at the label, don't mess with you. They don't care if it take you a year, two years. You make the record I need you to make. You do what's in you. I'm doing it for you. And Pages was made. It's something when somebody believes. So right at the point, now I'm going to tell y'all now, you might be in a position where people don't believe in you. People are backing out on you. Don't give up. For in due season, you will reap if you don't faint. All things are working, all right? I'm going to holler at y'all, all right? We going back to work. Come on, son. He, 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 he cord me, cord me, doc.